And Australia now quicker with Vegan and through the centre they will go with Nicholas Good. This is better, better from Australia. Nicholas Good on the switch, right to left. Oh, beautiful tap back in. And over goes Parlow for Australia. Some of their own here. Carla Savage is out there, the youngest member of the squad. Winning jumper 16. And he's only 17 years of age. Kane Rangi and with Aaron Nutai now. Five away from the line. Nutai's back with it. Goes right side. Beautiful play. Yeah, Nicholas Good on Q Gibbsy. Roll ball back for Hennessy. Pretty nonchalant in the way he picked it up. And Good is with it. Got the blue boots on. Gets it going for Hennessy. Right to left. What a ball. Oh, what a pass. And Hennessy accepts the touch. Then goes the quick roll ball. Gets in position to go to acting half. Hennessy just playing all sorts of games here against the Kiwis. Moylan then steers it to the right hand side. What a jump. New Zealand on their heels, but at the pace and the skill they're playing this game, you'd reckon they've got five touchdowns, a half of them here in Australia. Look at that ball. Rifled out to the corner. Five by Dylan Hennessy. And uh, the Australians again messing with the New Zealand defence physically, mentally here. And another white ball and another dive. But that time, Robert Nackla, the most likely Eruetti, Rangi to create. Look at that step and look at that pass over the top. Doesn't find the mark. Prowse is away this time for Australia. Prowse will get the touchdown. He was denied just a minute ago. Kane Rangi with it. Stops and passes for Graham. Back for Rangi. He's got this skip. He's uh, an habitual skipper. And the Kiwis come up with a touchdown to Dean Williams. The other players, like a Dylan Hennessy. Kane Rangi is very dangerous in New Zealand. Mind you, he's quick enough, Roberts. Doesn't have the step of uh, the number six Hennessy, though. But few do in the touch world. And what about that? Australia have opened him up like a sardine can there. Good. He's a bit of a bit of a, a, a touchdown sneak close to the line. He couldn't get any lower than how he looked to find his way to the line that time. Hennessy on the quick roll ball. And there is the easiest touchdown you'll see against this sort of defence. Gary Riley unsuccessful that time. Now Silbury and a nice switch there for Kane Rangi. Kept alive for Tivoli Guthrie. You've got to remember. So that touchdown, the only one for the Kiwis in 11 minutes of this second period. Hennessy's got Australia going again. There's a chance on that right-hand corner. We love seeing them die. And Brighton will do the job. This is Troy Malcolm and Malcolm's got it away. Parlow can run. Parlow can sprint, get set for the jump, there it is. Australia go on another drive inside the final two minutes now. Moylan dumped it off there for Hennessy. Hennessy with a jump, then the ball out on the left-hand side for Prowse, who slams it down, and there is another touchdown. It is business all said and done here, and mission accomplished in grand style for Australia. With the setting sun as the backdrop here in Mudgee, you have seen one of the most clinical and most skillful performances by an Australian side.